Good morning and welcome to the chaos that my room has become. It's just bad right now. Ooh. Hi, my name's Tiffany and this summer I'll be working and living in Blind Channel, a remote community on West Thurlow Island, complete with a marina, store, restaurant, and more. Come along and join the adventure. It has been a busy couple days and I've just been like non-stop and last night I was supposed to get off work at 6 but we had a tour up here and they all wanted to come into the store until like 6.30 and then we, um, and then I was going up to the bluff with my aunt so we went up there, got back at 7.30, I hung with them until their dinner reservation at 8. I came home, I ate, couldn't move, showered, came back, and then, and this is tidied up a little bit. So that's where we're at. <laughs> I think I'm gonna spend today and tomorrow trying to get my life back in order. That is the plan. But first I need to get dressed and get ready for work because um, I think it's like 8.30ish. And I need to leave soonish. I didn't think it possible, but it 100% got worse. <laughs> I mean, I did change on my lunch break and I took off my socks. <laughs> I don't know, these dog treats, it's, it's just bad. I just have to sit down because my body hurts. I really, truly, honestly thought I was going to spend today getting my life in order and a little bit tomorrow probably, but I forgot that it's one of the grandkids's, grandkids's, grandkids' birthdays. Well, they're having a party today and so I have to go over to that. Well, I don't have to, but I want to. And um, so that's where I'll be going. <laughs> Uh, maybe I'll throw some stuff in a hamper or something first. I want to change. It's actually quite nice out today. Um, I don't know how hot, but it's really nice. I also, look at my necklace that I got. It's so pretty. So, my aunt was here. But she missed, like, all of that. Um, she was here with her massive dogs and her boyfriend. I love those dogs. Wait, I have a picture or two. Look how cute they are. So, Maverick is on the, hmm... Maverick is the bigger one and Brandy is the smaller one with the bandana. They're so cute. And they actually just got Brandy a week ago. Um, fate. They were supposed to have another dog. So they ended up getting Brandy a week ago and she came out here. She absolutely loved it. We went up to the viewpoint last night. They're both mountain dogs. They both loved it. I died a little. But yeah, that's part of the reason everything's a mess. There's so much to do. But I'm going to reheat maybe the last of my KFC chicken. KFC. I don't need to add chicken. <laughs> and then get changed and then head over and then tonight maybe we'll try to tackle a little bit of this. I think laundry tomorrow probably. Maybe I'll get up early and do it. I don't know. We'll see but that's where we're at. This is, it's been a bad day for vlogging because we have actually been pretty busy. It's actually been nice the last couple days. We've had quite a few boats on the dock. Oh you know what? This is sitting crooked because wait can I get it to because I got a thing and it's on the plate for the thing. Give me two seconds. I bought myself a gimbal, the Ronin SC. I'm very excited about it. I really haven't had a chance to play with it because I've been working so much, but it's like, ooh. <laughs> ooh. Anyways, I've got it balanced for the camera, so like that's exciting. Um, but just getting used to the movement of it, which is like, It'll take a minute or two. Can I lock this up again? Do I know what I'm doing? Absolutely not. <laughs> but yeah, it's really nice. So I got this one because I'd been looking at the Ronin for a while. Hello, can you lock? There we go. I've been looking at the Ronin for a while, um, but it's, it's for like bigger cameras. And it was like, I think specifically capable compatible with some which was not the Canon M50. This one however is just for like any mirrorless that's um, 2kg or less and it specifically mentioned the Canon M50. So I got it. It's very exciting. I cannot wait to like use it and then to eventually get better at it because I know like the first couple shots will be bad. Maybe I'll throw in some test footage here if I think about it because I do have some from the first couple, from the first couple hours with it. I have not touched it since the first day.
but yeah, okay, I have talked for far too long now, <sighs> but it's, you're caught up, you're up to date. I'm gonna change, gonna put some food in, and um, I'll catch up with you along the way. Oh my goodness, I am up far too late. It is 22 11 and I haven't even started getting ready for bed yet. Just got back from the birthday party situation. Lots of fun, but socializing uh, takes out of me. But I also think I'm gonna socialize tomorrow, so yeah, it's fun. <laughs> Um, I think I'm gonna go over to the house and play cards with the adults later. I think that's the plan. So life getting in order, still not great. Although they did say, hey, just come over and do your laundry while we play cards. And I may just take them up on that because that is a lot of laundry. Eh. But for now, I think I'm gonna get ready for bed. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pajama up and um, I'll see you tomorrow as we continue to try to get my life in order. I guess as I continue to try to get my life in order and you just come along for the adventure. Also like, remember when um I actually edited vlogs I'm like so far behind and again I have like so much footage on various different cameras <sighs> I need to get my act together well hello and welcome back to I think it's day two of getting my life together but the fact that I don't know is just kind of how it is I have however rediscovered the majority of my floor here bed's still a disaster oh incoming boat um yeah it's better it is better it's not great but it is better i am on my break now lunch break a late lunch break we're actually i think gonna be pretty busy today we got quite a few boats that came in that were not registered or reserved to come in and then some other ones there's already like 20 people in the restaurant which is very exciting and um yeah so should be a good night if everything goes well and i think It'll work out because I don't think the family's gonna go for dinner tonight if there's so many people in there. Um, if everything works out, then I'm gonna go over and play cards with my, like, I'm. she's married into the family and we met out here and we just like bond it. Um, and so we like chat all the time on Instagram, it's great. So I'm gonna go over there. I did talk about doing laundry there last night, but I don't think I will. I think maybe I'll like message her and see what the plan is for like when I should come over there and I would likely have time to do laundry. I should have done it on my lunch to be honest, but it's fine. That's where we are at. Um, I just wanted to check in because I have not picked up a camera today because I've actually been busy. Lots of people checking out, lots of people checking in, lots of people buying things. And then in between all that, I'm trying to enter a ton of stuff into inventory. Um, on my computer and the internet is being terrible. And then I also have to do invoicing if I can. <sighs> and we're in town right now too, so there's gonna be a bunch of stuff coming back. So it's just a fun day, but that's where we're at. And hopefully laundry either today, if it doesn't get done today, it has to be done tomorrow because clothing situation is getting dire. Alrighty. Again, no idea what day it is of me getting my life together. <laughs> but I'm not getting my life together. I got invited for dinner um, at one of the family's house because me and her, I think I mentioned our great Instagram friends <laughs> slash in real life friends. So I've got my bag, I've got some snacks and uh, we're gonna play a board game and eat burgers and french fries, which is just ideal. So I'm just sneaking that way now, just down here. Oh, so nice. But yeah, it was a crazy hectic day for sure, but I am glad to be done and to have an opportunity to chill. I feel like I'm breathing way too fast. I've definitely been go, go, go all day. So anyways, I'll probably see you after now because awkward, but yeah, that's, that's what a night in blind town looks like sometimes. Burgers and board games. You can't go wrong. I'm stopping here because there might be people around. Okay. It got bad again. <laughs> I was looking for a shirt to wear to dinner and yeah. Yeah. Day two of getting my life in order is going much the same way as day one in which nothing happened <laughs> it's hilarious but i had a great time socializing we had burgers on the barbecue and some five minute fries delicious we went for a little walk <laughs> and then we played ticket to ride which is a game that the son got for his birthday and it was lots of fun super lost but it's okay it was fun um if I played again, I think I could do much better, but I am home now. It is just after 10. I think we get ready for bed here. I'm a little amped up. Um, socializing and all that. Also, like, as, like, dinner's almost ready, we're like, oh, my God, we don't have enough ketchup. And I was like, oh, we need to get tomatoes. Oh, we need to get milk. And I was like, 
I brought my store keys because I expected something like this would happen. And because we were coming up the roundhouse and they're like on the opposite side of the property, so we like just snuck over the next house, jacked the golf cart, <laughs> just ripping around. I was driving and I will say it was quest. I was going real fast at some points. Got ketchup and vinegar here, important. And then went to the store, got the things, and then like back. <laughs> and then my one boss was like, what are you guys doing? I was like, we need stuff for dinner. <laughs> And um, yeah, lots of fun. I can't tell if I'm like burnt or red or the lighting is just weird. Anyways, I think I'm gonna throw that stuff back in the hamper for like the fourth time and um, just vibe for a bit, listen to my audiobook, I think, and um, hope something productive happens here and that I get to sleep not too late. It was a busy day at work today and I expect it to be busy tomorrow, so. <laughs> I got a confession. No momentum Just because it's easy But that don't make it better of getting my life together. <laughs> it has been so chaotic this morning. I had to get an order done. Everybody was checking out. I did not stop until 12. It's just 12.30 now. And um, delicious bread behind me. Um, but now I'm just gonna roll into invoicing, which I'm behind on because I've been so busy in the store. But I think the store can manage a couple storms now if people come in. Oh. I need to fold clothes. I better go look at those first. I've been told it's a mess by multiple people. Uh, it's not as bad as it could be. It definitely does need some love though. <sighs> Maybe invoicing will be a post lunch ordeal today. I am home from work now <laughs> and I am wiped. <laughs> it was like pretty nonstop for customers and in between customers I was trying to one, keep the store semi in order which i never folded those clothes like i was going to um and to get a ton of computer stuff done <sighs> it is 6 30 i have my laundry and so that's exciting i have to make some food but i'm like really lazy um but eventually we'll get there i'm sure <sighs> i think like laundry will get done today <laughs> And that might be it for getting my life back together because I'm feeling a very early night. I think it's just, it is time, like, for context for how busy we were. We were in town yesterday. We got a lot of dairy and a lot of produce. And I probably have maybe half the produce left and almost no dairy. Like, I have three one liters of homogenized milk and then some yogurt. <laughs> And some eggs and then no bananas like almost no avocados like it was crazy so yeah anyways <laughs> we're not in town until friday which tomorrow is thursday so that's gonna be fun but yeah that's that's the situation we're at i'm i think i'm hungry i don't know i'm looking at like the strudel hairs on my bed sheet and i'm wondering if i should change my linens too like that would be peak getting my life together but maybe there'll be a tomorrow thing we'll see anyways that's the update it's a beautiful gorgeous day love that for us <laughs> and um i'm gonna try, just try not to fall asleep before i have to go lug i guess lug my laundry down to the um to the um laundry suite facility thing i'm trying to I think the back house is empty right now, so technically I could use that dryer, 
but last time I tried to use that dryer, it took like four, like two hours and it was brutal. But anyways, we'll see. I'm in charge of a Millie now. <laughs> My boss was going for dinner and he just brought me his dog. I was like, can you watch her? I was like, okay. <laughs> She's so cute. I couldn't say no. So we're gonna go for a walk, I guess. I was waiting in the undertow Set adrift with featherweight light bulbs Unaware of where my heart would flow I was waiting in the undertow Can't touch the bottom Sit into a tumble Waves that shake me out Out of my skin Never been so easy Losing my direction My bearings have me south of home I've been wrong before I was waiting in the undertow Set adrift with fairway light bulbs Unaware of where my heart would flow I was waiting in the undertow Alrighty, well, it is 9.15 now. I just dropped Millie off at the house because she was struggling a little bit, like with anxiety. I don't know if it was because she was in here with other people and one who she's like a little skittish around, or if it was just because she missed her humans, but I brought her down to the restaurant so she could see her humans and they were, she was like, oh my God, you still exist and you still love me, which was good for her. And then I just brought her home and dropped her off in her house because they're just about done. They're just having dessert. So I'm sure she will be a happy pup. I'm making a lot of noise here because I'm charging my GoPro battery, my extra one. And um, my laundry is done. As you can see, it is right here. And I'm trying to decide if I want to fold it or not. <laughs> The um, first answer that comes to my mind is no, but I'm supposed to be in my life together, which means I should fold that. So I think I'm gonna chill for a couple, maybe till 9.30 and then reassess then. I also kind of wanna have a shower or at least wash my feet because I've been romping around in my native shoes lately, which are like basically Crocs and my feet are just really, really gross. So maybe I'll do that. But I'm gonna listen to my audiobook for a while because I got interrupted with puppy sitting. I have regressed. <laughs> I've got my PJs on now. I've got a bag of chips. I've been listening to my podcast, audiobook. That's what I was gonna go for. I was gonna say audio cast. I was like, that's wrong. And I, and I freaked out and I went the other way. And um, I am done for the day, I think. I'm gonna listen a little bit longer than probably climb into bed with a show, which will be very exciting. My feet could uh, definitely use some cleaning, but maybe I'll something. Oh my God, all the bug bites, so bad. <laughs> and good news, I think the spider bite that I got has finally stopped pussing, so that's when, but yeah, I think I'll probably clean my feet because that's real gross. And then tomorrow, I think, put away all my clothes, vacuum, change my sheets. And then I think we've got our life together. Only for it to probably fall apart over the weekend if it gets busy, but yeah. it's fine. Anyways, I'm out for the night. I'll see you tomorrow. Hello, hello to day four, I think, five? Day four of getting my life together. It is currently 2.15 and it is a Thursday. And oh, <laughs> it's just been so busy in the store for me with inputting stuff like I mentioned yesterday and with customers and orders and all that fun stuff but finally 
The store is faced. I got a bunch of stuff out. The floor is swept and mopped. Surfaces are clean. So the store is, the store has its life in order. Um, my breakfast buddy is covering my break and she's going to be putting out, is flushing out all the liquor and stuff that can go out because we're getting liquor tomorrow and we're getting case coat to tomorrow, which is like all our dry stuff. And we're getting produce and dairy tomorrow. And <laughs> so that's fun. I think what I'm going to do, I'm on a break right now, obviously. I'm going to, oh, I want to switch my sheets. Should I switch my sheets? I should switch my sheets. Okay. I was going to say I'm going to make my bed, but I'm going to switch my linens instead. Oh, oh, there was a thing. Earlier today, there was a mayday call nearby, and this boat, I think, sounds like it hit a rock and started sinking bow down. And um, so, like, Coast Guard went. There was oh, another vessel that went. Um, one of our boats went insane. I don't know what the resolution was to that. Like, I don't know if they were able to float the boat. I think that's what they're trying to do. They're trying to pump it out and float it. Or if they had to, um, let me just put you over here. Or if they had to just wait for the Coast Guard environmental squad. I don't think it's called an environmental squad, but I don't know what the solution was, but definitely something was happening. So that was crazy. Some people on the dock were talking about it, but nobody really had more details. I was listening on um, 84 Alpha, 83 Alpha, whatever their working channel is, I was listening on that one um, so I could listen to the drama. But yeah, so, oh look, there's my pajamas. <laughs> it's, um, yeah, been a very exciting day. All right, we're gonna strip this and go find another sheet, hopefully, because I will be very sad if there are no more double sheets around, but there should be at least one. And um, then at least that portion of getting my life together will be dealt with. Uh, after work, I'm going to go over to Edgar's because I'm gonna go talk to um, Sarah, who is my Instagram slash blind channel friend, whatever, um, about what she has done there because over the next, couple like the next week or so before the first group comes in I might be working in the store and then after my shift going over there and doing stuff so that'll be fun I'll be tired but it definitely needs to be done and I have the skill set to do it so joy anyways I'll check in with you as I can because as I'm trying to get my life in order and like in the store and stuff I can't really vlog in the store right now because there's just too many people but I will try my best remember a few hours ago when I said the store was fine so this is empty, that we just don't have. This is empty and <laughs> it's so bad. <laughs> it's so bad. Like, okay, it's time to make things pretty again. Oh my God. Alrighty, well, I'm home now. It is 10 to seven and I'm like halfway through changing. I'm not wearing any pants. And <laughs> I was like, what should I wear? And then I was thinking, I want to shower. That is one of the things I want to do today to continue to put my life back together. And I have to wait for my pork chops to defrost anyways. So I think we're just going to shower now. And um, then get into some super comfy clothes. And then I think vacuum my room. And then I think we're pretty good. And then like cream of the crop would be, I guess cherry on top is more of what I want to say, would be if I can edit some vlogs. It'd be fantastic if I could get my packing vlog edit it and then the rest export it this is like really ambitious and then send them out on the mail plane tomorrow we'll see fingers crossed unlikely but maybe anyways <sighs> I'm gonna go do that now and I'll catch you when I'm clean and with that I am clean it feels so good squeaky clean I really hate the shower though because it takes so, it's so small it takes like double the time to do anything but legs are even shaved which is like an accomplishment because most of the time I'm too lazy to make that happen even in town when I have a regular size shower but especially out here but yeah <laughs> okay better so I think I'm probably I'll probably turn on the oven at the moment it doesn't take too long to heat up and then get into some clothes I'm thinking sweats and then start cooking and while I'm cooking maybe vacuum I haven't decided what I want to have for a side um with my cake with my pork we had nugget potatoes but we don't have any right now and also I'm way too lazy to go down and we have russet potatoes so I could have done like a baked potato but didn't think about that until like just now. So maybe rice or maybe 
craft dinner. Can't go wrong with craft dinner. Okay. <sighs> I'm going to get dressed and then we will move on to the next step. I'm just looking at all these clothes here. I'm going to at least put on some of them maybe. Oh, I could wear pajamas. No, sweats. I want sweats. Okay. Well, I was doing well <laughs> about getting my life back together, getting the vlog edited until people came over and then I was social. And that is a thing that happened and it's totally okay, but it's like 10 to 12, which is maybe not okay. And I did get about 10 minutes of the vlog edited, which is about a third of the way through. I thought it was only like 12 minutes long and it was because I just didn't add all the footage and that's my bad. <laughs> but I've made progress. However, I did discover a fatal flaw that past Tiffany ordained to put me through <laughs> in which I said, yeah, I'll link the video about how I got to be working in remote places here. I haven't filmed it. <laughs> so I guess I need to get on filming that. Maybe that'll be a thing I do tomorrow. I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to have to do cleaning or whatnot, but I think my life is pretty much together. I'm showered. I'm cleaned. My room is clean. My bed is made. All my clothes are away. I vacuumed the whole house. I swept the floor in the whole house. I cleaned the kitchen. I put away all the dishes. Like, I think I did all right. It took me four days, but we got there in the end. Tomorrow is another day. It's probably going to be kind of busy. I mean, I think all days now are going to be kind of busy and we'll be getting our supplies in later in the day. And then Saturday will be hectic because it's going to be putting all those supplies out. So fun, 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 fun. But at least I feel like I'm on pretty solid footing to get into this and I'm having crazy allergies right now, which is terrible, but I have more allergy medicine coming tomorrow. Hopefully if my breakfast buddy can find it, so that is fantastic. And then I guess we'll continue working on this, um, but also need to film that other thing. I just really need to find somewhere where I can sit down and film some talking bits, I think. I don't think it's gonna be long. I'm just gonna talk about Kayuket, um, which is the first place I worked remotely, and then Blind Channel, obviously. So that's the plan. Getting a text. Who knows what that is? It's an Instagram post that was shared. And um, yeah, I'm gonna go now. Thanks for coming along, helping me get my life together, holding me accountable in some regard. And tomorrow we're um, just back at the daily grind. Good night.